almost home liners. This is how you know you're old when you celebrate buying a home with Satoshi and Michelle. Made in Washington. Yeah. so weird greeting you guys not saying from Pacific Northwest but I have to get used to it we have moved to our house here in Colorado Springs this past one and a half month have been very very busy for us I have plenty of backup vlogs that I haven't posted yet because um, First week of November, our internet in Washington get cut because they have to pick up all our household goods and everything. Like around um, first week of November, our household goods got picked up. We cleaned the house, finish up everything in the house. Then mid-November, we move out of the house in Lakewood and went on vacation. household goods or before the what do you, you call it? Um, yes before the packers or movers comes on Friday to pack all our stuff um, yeah, pretty much we're just throwing all the um, expired stuff and take out all the stuff that we need to finish at least before we go Turn this in. Yeah. Damn. Oh. He left yesterday, huh? Oh. Alright, so this is our house right now, pretty much. on Tuesday they're gonna come in um, pick up all our stuff on Tuesday so this is um, three-day deal 
and like last time one day yeah just one day yeah pack and ship that's what they did last time when we were in El Paso um, they came around six well during seven o'clock in the morning and by three o'clock our house is empty wow it's because of COVID they got you know more time to waste so this lady from the army stopped by to check up on everything make sure everyone's in regs yeah, she looked at Giselle's mustache and told her, oh man, that mustache is out of regs. Yeah, you know, she's, she saw it. It goes past the lip and they said, oh no, that's not the service member. She and she it. saw it because I wasn't wearing mask. Yeah. So anyway, yeah, no, she actually came to, um, to check if every, if the um, packers are, um, you know, wearing doing, their mask. wearing their mask. They drop off this paperwork. She dropped off this paperwork um, regarding the um, um, COVID thing. So yeah, this is uh, new stuff that they are following right now. Um, they just want to make sure that us, as a customer, don't have you know COVID symptoms or anything that can um, you know um, what do you call it? Can slow down. Get or sick. like uh, get anyone sick yeah transmit the virus if that was what I meant yeah so because this is three day process we have to submit this for th um, three um, you know one 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 form each day they come over here um, joint personal property shipping office of the Northwest um, drop off the um, paperwork also you know how to do the claims and everything all the um, all the movers will disassemble all our stuff this weekend we'll still have our TV but we don't have any more internet and cable service so TV is useless anyway yep so this is our house look like right now bring this back to Dylan <laughs> what happens when you pay for the premium helium at party city lasts for weeks bro it's already month it's about dead we'll see if we can get it to arizona <laughs> so these are the stuff that they didn't pack packed up but um they're really kind enough to pack some stuff for us right over here to to take with us yeah these are our office a lot of stuff in here okay so this is our guest bedroom pretty much everything is done right over here they're just gonna disassemble the bed okay so now what we don't have TV, we don't have um, internet. Me and Chad will just gonna play board game. <laughs> Alright, today is Monday, second day of packing. The Packers came last Friday to start with the, um, the bedroom, the bathroom, the kitchen, but um, they're going to finish off the rest today, including the garage. This is the hardest thing ever to clean the oven, but this year or this time, it is the easiest one huh? that I did. That one did. Excuse me. I cleaned it. Excuse me. <laughs> so this is the magic button. How Chad Douglas cleaned the oven right here. Work smarter, not harder. He cleaned it for three hours. Putting that work in. So. 
the electric oven and stove has this clean option right over here you just click it and it will do the cleaning itself mm -hmm. so did you have fun here in washington yeah i had fun it's a great state i'm gonna come back here and open up my business I had fun too. Washington was a great experience for us. Actually, wherever we go, as long as you know, you make most of it, you think positive about everything, everything will be okay. Um, a lot of people hated, hated to be stationed over here because it rains a lot. Um, you know, when it rains a lot, you appreciate a beautiful weather when it when the sun is out and the mountain is out another thing is um i like this place because there are plenty of adventure plenty of um, things to do outdoors rain or shine it's it's always beautiful plenty of places to eat and to see I met a lot of um, people. beautiful people. We also have friends that we met in Texas that came here in Washington. Or so we're here in Washington. Now we're going off to our new adventure in Colorado. We are leaving in on Saturday. Speaking of people who we met here in. <laughs> Want the bliss and then over here. Oh, the Bacante. Hey, what's up, brother? Uh, we're going to Colorado Springs. They're like, I've been here too long. They want to kick my ass out. Yeah, I was already here 46 months. They're like, yeah, you gotta leave. You gotta leave. You know what I'm saying? McKenzie is his Filipino brother who helped us when we first uh, hey, yeah man he, he, he helped us out a lot yeah he helped us when we first moved here in Washington when we first came here we don't have house to live we were homeless and he's uh, the one who I was on the corner what's up man let me get a rock he provide us a room to to sleep for a week before we found this house he also took us for um you know a good trip to to his um, in-laws in oak harbor we experienced our first ferry ride here in washington with, yeah with them Oh my goodness, look how thick this thing that we, we signed. Never thought house or home buying is this stressful. So tell me what we did today. Uh, I signed the closing documents just for the mortgage. So the notary came and she specialized in this mortgage and then um, she went through page by page what everything was and then we just signed it. Yeah. Congratulations. Congratulations. To the new owner. Uh, actually we should shake hands with the right hand. Mm -hmm. <laughs>